Students' eyes were watering, mouths burning, and arms were flying at the jalapeno eating contest hosted by Sigma Lambda Alpha. The contestant who ate the most jalapenos in two minutes would win the contest. Contestant Alexa DeVries had never eaten a jalapeno before the contest, but she won't forget the burn of her first one for a while. Um, when I was eating the jalapenos, it kind of felt like there was a giant bonfire inside of my mouth, and I thought that it was hot right when I started eating it, but then all of a sudden it started getting hotter and hotter and hotter, and then all of a sudden I was like, wow, this is, this is a problem, and so I just kind of started stuffing bread in my mouth, and yeah, it was, it's still hot, actually. Alexa says she only ate two and a half jalapenos, but she thought overall it was a good experience. I've never had a jalapeno before, and after this experience, I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to again, but I'm really glad that I did this. It was really fun. Nikki Vogt was another contestant. Unlike DeVry, she had eaten a lot of jalapenos in the past. She thought she would do well because of her South Texas background. Like down where I live, there's a lot of jalapeno eating contests, but I never did one. So I was like, okay, this might be kind of easy because of where I live, but they were hot. Vogt's experience wasn't enough to win her the contest. For the first time in more than 10 years, Sigma Lambda Alpha is hosting a jalapeno eating contest in recognition of Hispanic Heritage Month. This year the event's small, but they hope in the future it will grow in size. Jessica Velasquez says the event was all about recognition of Hispanic Heritage Month. Right now we're just trying to bring awareness and hopefully later on they'll come to our more serious events. The winner of the contest says he did not want to be interviewed, but Velasquez said the winner ate a total of nine jalapenos. Sarah Fleischer, TCU News Now.